Let's talk about T3. I get this question all the time. Can I take T3 when I'm pregnant? Can I take T3 now if I know I want to get pregnant in the future? So let's talk about T3 and fertility. T3 plays a crucial role in egg quality, ovulation, and cycle regulation. Without sufficient T3 egg maturation, luteal phase function, and implantation success might be compromised. So I always say this, T3 helps you get pregnant and stay pregnant. Now, medicine in general says, oh my God, do not, do not use T3 in pregnant women. The baby won't have access to enough T4 and the T3 doesn't cross the placental barrier. Guess what guys? Two things can happen at once. People can have enough T3 and they can also have enough T4. You know how I know? I actually freaking check it, right? Like if you're trying to infer all of these data points, all from a TSH, I can see how clinicians would be anxious. There's a really simple solution and it's just to check TSH free T4 to ensure the baby has access to it, free T3, reverse T3 and antibodies. So let's just do it. I have successfully taken women with infertility, a history, literally one of them had nine miscarriages and took her through successful pregnancy by optimizing thyroid and hormones to an extent too, right?